The season started off really well with the three wins. Um, however, then we ran into some bad luck with being taken out a few times and the tyre blowing up. Uh, so that was unfortunate. And then Toronto, I made quite too many mistakes. So it's been an up and down year so far, um, but that's to be expected. With my, my first year and Carlin's first year over in America, we still have a lot to learn and um, I think we're working as hard as possible to make sure that we don't make the same mistakes for the future. I think the hardest thing has been the oval racing. It's so much different to what I expected it to be. Um, and just the whole atmosphere in, in America is a lot of things are quite a lot more personal than in Europe with the racing. Um, but you get used to it and um, I'm really enjoying it so far. On a positive note, the um, mixture of racing has been really enjoyable, especially having never raced on ovals before. Having to adapt to that has made a new challenge for myself, but I've taken to it well and um, that's been great. In addition, the street circuit venues uh, Long Beach, Toronto and St. Pete have been great places to race at, especially with all the fans, so much following there and they seem to be really interested in the racing so it's been great for the drivers and um, overall it's, most things have been positive about racing over here and I'm looking forward to racing for a long time. So leading up to every race event and test event, we do a lot of work with the engineers looking at past video and data just to get a good idea of what, what's to be expected for the corners, the speeds and the gears. Um, once I'm comfortable with that, you do quite a lot of uh, visualisation um, just to get more confident and to know exactly what to do when every situation occurs. Um, you then move on to the simulator just to embed those thoughts and um, ideas even more and then you're pretty much ready for the circuit so that as soon as you get on to the track you can start attack attacking from lap one. Yeah, so we do a lot of training because it's very tough um, driving the cars. Um, a lot of cardio running, uh, cross training and swimming. Um, in addition, some weight, body weight work um, just to keep up the fitness. But the main thing is you can never replicate completely driving the car. So you can get to a certain point, but then stuff with the neck and other parts of the body is just from race fit.